Hello everybody. I wanted to do a quick review on some uh, ores. Uh, I bought some aluminum ores and uh, also some ore stops. Uh, particular ones I got, Crooked Creek. These are aluminum, uh, aluminum shaft. It's a one and a quarter inch shaft. And uh, this particular ore is six and a half feet. The ore stops that I bought called Ordeal. This. And uh, they're really pretty easy to put on. So I'm going to give a quick description on uh, how I put them on. It is first thing you need to do is you need to go and lay this out uh, on your boat where the ore lock would be uh, so it's positioned perfectly so uh, where your hands are going to be they're going to be evenly spaced apart um, i like to have mine about two inches to four inches at the most um, between the handles and uh, some people like to have them almost within like an inch um, some people don't like them a little further out but three to four inches for me. Once you do that, then you go and, and lay the ore out. Uh, so it's just like that. And you can make a mark where the ore lock would be positioned at. So you can see where the ore stop needs to be. From there, you put the ore stop, mark it right at the bottom. So you know where, where you need to stop it. Because the way this thing goes on, is you take this rubber and you put it on this cone here and you put the cone on the top of the handle like this and you roll it down like a donut and as you roll it uh, and it slides down onto the shaft as you pull this off and you continue rolling it all the way down like a donut roll 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 till the bottom gets down to right here. Once you get it to right here, then you roll it back up and it'll snap right in place and it'll be perfectly positioned where you had measured. Um, for this particular one, uh, this uh, ore stop is uh, designed for uh, one and a half inch shafts, um, but I read some reviews by other people that said that it works on these one and a quarter inch aluminum shafts. Uh, it is not real tight, um, it's just snug, um, but it seems to seems to work. My first impressions are that it's gonna be just fine. Um, one person did say that, hey, uh, if you're worried about it, you could put some glue, glue down, but it uh, seems snug to me. And uh, another thing is this uh, uh, handle, uh, it's a uh, rubber foam. And some people mentioned that after some heavy use, the uh, uh, handle will start to get loose. So you might need to put some glue, glue on it. Another thing I read was some people complained that uh, water was getting inside and then going in the shaft and it wasn't draining out. Uh, there was only a few posts like that. So we'll see how it works for me. Um, there was also some people that were complaining about these aluminum shafts that uh, they would break. Now I noticed every picture that I saw, they were breaking right where uh, the ore lock was. And I also noticed that people were using the clamp-on type ore locks instead of the sliding one like this. And I think maybe what's happening is uh, uh, because these shafts are hollow, they're tightening the clamps down just a little too tight. And then that becomes the point where of torque when they're rowing and it puts uh, too much stress right there where it's already being you know crushed down by the clamps anyway and so that's where they're failing uh, i have a friend that has uh it's a different brand but same concept um or he's had his for almost 20 years and i've been going fishing with him and uh, his oars works just fine so uh, hopefully uh, uh, these will work out good for me too uh, I'll use them a few times, uh, maybe in a couple weeks or so, and uh, I'll post an update. All right. Thanks, guys. Uh, see you on the water.
Good luck. Fish on. Block this parking spot off where uh, you could park uh, oh, five, 